I've assembled the, the wheel assembly. Um, initially, I made the wheel as per the SVGs as of the plywood, but I decided I thought I'd experiment with printing the wheel in uh, PLA wood uh, in the hope that I wouldn't need to veneer it. So I've done that, I've put it in there and I took the liberty of putting a little butterfly motif in there as well and it um, is printed very accurately and it turns well. Um, the assembly of the wheel is quite simple according to the instructions. Uh, the, the knob I've um, printed in wood as well. This is a failed print so I'm printing another one at the moment and the knob goes on here somewhere. So that's a fairly straightforward part of the assembly except I would have, if I was doing it again, assembled the wheel before putting the top on because it's quite fiddly getting it in there. Uh, now, now that it's in there you can easily uh, unassemble it but um, by removing the back panel and pulling the whole thing out, unscrewing the wheel, pulling the whole thing out. Um, but to do the initial assembly I think it would have been easier to do it without the top. Um, the other thing I've done is I've started cutting the sides. Um, here we are. Uh, and what I've done is I've only cut the slots halfway through the plywood, one and a half millimeters, so that the outside is is nice pristine plywood and I'm quite pleased with the result because there's plenty of there's plenty of bend in it and I should be able to wrap that around the sides without any uh, difficulty. So I'm just going to uh, mill the other side and then I, I will attach the sides. So um, that is the next step of my build completed. I think once I've put the sides on um, there's going to be a little bit of elbow grease with sanding it, uh, getting it ready before I uh, put the bridge in and the machine heads and the strings and all that sort of stuff. So it's, I think put the sides on just about ready for the cosmetic sanding. I haven't made up my mind what colour to stain it yet. Um, I'll probably surprise myself. And thank you for watching this section of my video.